Isn't that an irritating sound? But it's not nearly as bad to hear as it was in 1917 or 1918 when bigger versions of this noisemaker sounding on the Western Front meant that your unit had just been hit with poison gas. Poison gas was one of only one of the many dangers of World War I faced by American troops uh, who arrived there and joined the great European war in its final year. A war that would conclude with a big offensive breaking the strongest German fortifications at the Hindenburg Line, where South Carolina troops were right at the front and in the thick of that fighting. The relic rooms exhibit on the 30th Division and its battles on the Western Front in the final offensive of the war uh, will teach you a lot about these events of a century ago.